Alright, so some of you might have noticed I haven't uploaded in a few days. Um, you know, if you've seen Twitter or Community Tab or one of my previous videos before it stopped uploading, I got, you know, this really strong fever. And until like yesterday, it was horrible. Uh, but today I'm feeling quite decent, so... I was like, I think I can record the video. I still have some uh, <clears throat> minor coughs here and there. Uh, but for the most part, I'm feeling pretty good. So, yeah. Thank you for the people on Twitter that said uh, they wished me a good recovery. That uh, it, was a, it was an okay recovery. It took A, a fever shouldn't take a week. And it's, it's like eight days. Um, which I'm not, I'm not fully, you know, done with. Uh, but I'm almost, almost done, so... Um, I wanted to make a video, a uh, break out of my, uh, my, uh, my fever, my fever induced uh, YouTube comma here, um, because they buffed Margaret. Now, I don't know if this is a result of the horrible Korean showcase, um, and they're, they're still embarrassed about losing to Bond twice, but I feel like this is a very unnecessary buff because she was very good. Like, I, I, I would say, I, I don't think Margaret was, like, broken or anything. But she was definitely very good. Um, and, you know, as more goddesses come out, I feel like she would have had even a better place in the game. But now they made her the best unit in the game. Like, it, it's, it's not even fair. Like, all they did, I mean, they, they did two things, but one of the things is irrelevant. What they did was they changed the blue card. Before, um, if you know, if you already you know knew what, what Margaret did, um, she would increase the damage you do to type advantage, and decrease the damage you take towards the type disadvantage. So, let's say you have a full mono blue, your character is going to do more damage against red and take less damage against green. Now. <laughs> You just do more damage and take less damage. So, and you cleanse. So they change it that the blue card from level 1 cleanses and for 2 turns increases damage to all enemies by 30% and decreases damage from all enemies by 20%. And it goes up, of course. 45, 30. Increases basic stats by 20, 50, 40. Again, all cleansing. That, that is insane like uh, that is the the biggest buff i've ever seen um that this card and i said this before like this card is really good but when you don't face type advantage you're really you know not doing much with it other than the uh the increased stats but now you're doing extra 50 percent regardless so that's insane also the other thing they change is that at 6-6 you have an extra effect on the ultimate. It's um, the same effect as uh, like Red Ram. Let me actually read it off. Blocks all skill effects, including those of ultimate moves, and decreases ultimate move damage by 30% for two turns. Um, I, it's okay. Like I think that if you're facing Bond, and you, for example, you ult Arthur, and you kill Arthur, and Bond has an ultimate, for example. If you seal Bond's ability to do double damage with his ultimate, that's really helpful. But that was a very unnecessary buff. Um, like, it, it's... I think it makes sense, because festival characters usually have very strong ultimates, and this was not a very strong ultimate. Except like Zaldris. Like, <laughs> Zaldris is a joke. Like, really. Um, Zaldris is literally a, a joke of a festival. Um, he's just not very good. And they they don't even give him anything. But Margaret, they give like this absurd buff. So I'm, I'm gonna just try it out. Um, this is the same team I've been using. And I'm gonna... I'm, I'm really expecting to see more Margarets. Um, also, I think a reason why they decide to do this is because uh, no one summoned. I mean, it, it's obvious. Like, uh, it's Margaret. Uh, it's not a hype character like Ascanor, and the banner like only has one character, so it's it, it's not good value, right? So I think now 
Should 25, huh? I think that now... Oh, there's PvP rules, huh? Uh, I guess I'll play ungeared. Um, now the PvP rule for the week is... Um, everyone has 100% extra defense. That's fine. Um, I'll play ungeared. It's okay. Yeah, I'm, re I'm recording in the bed. Because, uh, you know, I'm still a bit sick. So. It's a, it's a bot. Yeah, that's fine. We're gonna just uh, do the, the Margaret attack. And uh, we're gonna go to one geared. I mean, yeah, I'm assuming everyone's running Tarmio. <laughs> Um, because of the, the rule of the extra defense. Uh, I wish I had made a video on- I mean, I can still do. I still have time uh, until Sunday <clears throat> to make a video on the uh, the Tarmio with, uh, with uh, extra defense from the, the, the rule for sure. Just want to see how much damage I can do here. I'm not... Not maxed out, am I? I don't think so. I don't think so. Forty-one k. I'll be maxed out. Let me do this again. She cleanses, so you saw the uh, the golfer got cleansed right there. It's like that was <laughs> that was so unnecessary to add. That's with my enemies having increased 100% defense, by the way. I just did 1.2 mil type neutral. I know it's a bot, but like... It's it's still 100% extra defense. It's just absurd. Actually absurd buff. Uh, Alright, let me uh, let me uh, skip showing geared here. Let me... Let me I mean, the, the ult didn't get like a damage buff. The ult just got the extra effect, which again, very unnecessary. I don't know why they add that. Um, but you can see it activates on Gale Thunder right there. Yep. Okay. Hmm. I guess I'll just go for this. Using Droll's Taunt just to waste a card, really. Oh, I don't even have to worry about the attack weakening because I can cleanse. The cleansing part for me is just... <laughs> I just slap in the face because... <clears throat> some blue cards, like let's say Red Easton, their first level 1 is just cleanse. Right? It's just cleanse. And then, at level 2, it, gain, it gains an effect. Her card just cleanses all the way through. It's actually absurd. I'm gonna do this. If we can get a... Yeah, I was gonna say a draw blue card, that'd be nice. Can I still kill? I think instead of using the, the draw the draw blue card, I'm gonna petrify. Because <clears throat> uh I am going to do extra damage, but he does have the damage reduction. Yeah. Mm, maybe I would have killed, actually. I killed the draw, but... I think maybe I would have killed with the draw blue card if I used it. Perhaps. <laughs> Goddesses, huh? See... There's nothing wrong with using uh, Margaret in the Goddesses team. But I don't know. 
I feel like, uh, <clears throat> especially now with the extra 50% damage, the ad like the the absurd boost that you get from the level three is just worth using God for much more. I feel like over just using a goddess team. So they're gonna they're gonna have to make a gonna have to make Mayo very strong to make it worth using uh, okay. using him over Galfer. No, what we really need is a, a character to replace Droll. Droll's good. Atrophy. Uh, the whole like, you no, know, the more buffs he has, the more attack he gives to the allies. He's definitely not bad. But could use another unit. Only guys, Liz died. Yeah, he had the damage reduction as well. I feel like we fought the damage reduction, he would have actually died. Alright, I'm gonna, I'm gonna end the video here. Or maybe not. Wish I had a blue card right now. I mean, he could cleanse. Oh. That is unfortunate. He could cleanse. No, okay. Yeah, you see. It's, um... Uh, it's a, it's a little unfair that Zaldrus didn't get the same treatment when, you know, we all realized that he was, like, not so good <clears throat> in comparison to other festivals. But they decided Margaret was uh, the golden girl to get the buff. So yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna end it because I, I don't know if I can keep recording. <laughs> I don't know if I can keep recording, I don't know if my fever will let me. Yeah, thank you guys for watching.